To begin editing PDF files on an iPad, the first thing we need to do is download the PDF file to the iPad. For this example, I'm using an assignment in Microsoft Teams. Click on the PDF and it will open in a new window. I can save it to my files by clicking on the share button in the top right. Look for the share menu item that says Save to Files. Select the On My iPad folder and click Save. The PDF is now saved and we can find it in order to mark it up. In order to do this, we open the Files app. You can search for it by swiping down in the center of the screen and typing in Files. There it is. We're in the On My iPad folder, and there is our PDF file. Just click to open it. At the top right is the Markup button. It looks like a marker. This opens the Markup toolbar at the bottom of the screen. The tools include a pencil, a highlighter, a marker, an eraser, a selection tool, and a ruler for drawing straight lines. Double tapping any tool will give you more options, like stroke width and the stroke opacity. You can also change the color of each tool. The plus button allows adding text and shapes to your document. Drag the text box to the desired location and double tap to edit. To write, tap on the pen tool and fill in the blanks. There is also an undo button in case you make mistakes. It happens. When I'm done, I have a few options. I can click on the share square again, and I can send this document that I've marked up to any app or contact on my iPad. Right now, I'm just going to click on done. This saves the marked up PDF. I can click on it again to double check. Let's go back to Teams. As a student, I may want to turn in my edited copy of the document. This same process applies to teachers uploading files to Teams as resources for assignments. Tap the Add Work button. A new window appears showing file locations like OneDrive. Students could even create new files here. For now, just choose Upload from this device. Tap Browse, but notice you can also add photos here. Recent files show by default, and there's our PDF. You can also choose Browse to see the same files menu you use to save the PDF. The edited PDF is uploaded to Teams. When it's finished, tap Done. We're almost there. The only thing left to do is tap Turn In. Note that this example used Teams but it also applies to many other apps on the iPad as well.